Well, you guys might find yourself in a situation like this one day. Uh, I was out flying the MJX 800, had a crash, and well, I'm not sure whether it was because of the crash or whether it was a crash that caused it, but basically this motor had stopped spinning. So now we've got a down hexacopter, so we've got to fix it. So we've noticed here, if I can get in there, uh, you might be able to see that all these motors are plug and play but I don't have any plug and play motors so what these look like seven mil motors so I've got plenty of spare seven mils so I'm going to try and splice these wires which are a pain because they're really really skinny so they're a pain to strip so all I did to get to this stage was unscrew uh, from the bottom Reminds me of a joke, but I won't go there. Uh, took took that one off because that's one I need to replace, and now I've got to try and find my spare motors. And um, yeah, see if I can solve them together. Can you believe it, guys? I'm actually making a serious video. What's the world coming to? Now, so what I'm gonna do? I've already spliced the white one, so. Just putting solder on the joins here. I oh, love the smell of solder. It's great, isn't it? So yeah, as you can see, I'm far from an expert at this, but uh, you sort of get into this hobby, you sort of learn how to solder, do things a bit makeshift like I do. Anyway. That should hold. Uh, so what we've got, we've got two joins there. Um, so that should hold and I need to find some sort of insulation, uh, maybe sticky tape, something high tech so these uh, wires don't rub together. So anyway, I'm gonna put this back together now and uh, see if it works. So the question is, does it work? Well, right, it's up in the air. Ah, uh, this does not make a very good inside flyer. But, yep, it looks like it works, so there you go. If you haven't got spare motors available, you can use uh, something else. But, yeah, it seems to work. And there's a flip. There's another flip. Yeah, I think this is more of an outside flyer. There you go, I don't think there are any, you know, I sort of had a look for spare motors before for the 800, but couldn't really find anything. Well, I did on eBay, but cost a fortune. So there you go, plug and play, splice the motor in. Seems to be reasonably stable. Anyway. Graceful landing as ever. It's a... Uh, painted it Stuart landing. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hopefully you got something out of an attempt at a serious video.